hi everyone how are you welcome to another videos for mrcs exam and this is question and answer session and the question solve is one of the best way to make yourself uh, for a better exam and pass the exam very easily so here the question first of all read the question very carefully to find out the key points from here so here which of the following structures separate the posterior cruciate ligament from the popliteal artery so it is one of the direct question that's here we can see what is the structure which separates the posterior cruciate ligament and from the popliteal fossa so we have to find out the structure which lies between the popliteal artery and posterior cruciate ligament so here are the options the options are oblique popliteal ligament transverse ligament popliteus tendon biceps femoris and semi tendinosus so in the popliteal fossa we have to find out a uh, structure which is located or who is intervening between the two structure one is the posterior cruciate ligament and another one is the popliteal artery and we know that the posterior cruciate ligament it is very close or it is uh, attached to the bones and popliteal artery it is the second most common structure or second most vessels which lies very close to the bones so here in this picture we can see there are two cruciate ligament uh, this is the anterior cruciate ligament and here this is the posterior cruciate ligament and this cruciate ligament anterior cruciate ligament it uh, attached anterior to the anterior side of the tibia and posterior cruciate li ligament it attached to the posterior side of this tibia in this picture we can see here and some other structures such as here the medial meniscus and it is the lateral uh, meniscus so this uh, some of the structure we can see this is the medial meniscus lateral meniscus anterior cruciate ligament posterior cruciate ligament and whole is the knee joint in the second picture we also can see here the posterior part in posteriorly here the posterior cruciate ligament and in this picture the posterior cruciate ligament it uh, attached to the posterior part of the tibia and here the lateral meniscus here the medial meniscus so now we have to find out the structure which lies posterior to this posterior cruciate ligament but anterior to the popliteal artery so let's see next in this picture we can see this is the posterior cruciate ligament and this posterior cruciate ligament we can see behind the posterior cruciate ligament there is another ligament this is the oblique popliteal ligament so this ligament uh, it lies somewhat obliquely so it is oblique popliteal ligament because it, this ligament also attached to the popliteus so here uh, we can see the tendon of semi membranosus here and here we can see this is the popliteus and semi membranous expansion over the popliteus so here this is the semi membranosus and we can see a important ligament this is oblique popliteal ligament and this oblique popliteal ligament it lies posterior to this ligament and this is the posterior cruciate ligament so in this picture this picture is clear i think because this is the oblique post popliteal ligament and the oblique popliteal ligament it lies anterior to this artery this is the popliteal artery and popliteal artery it also very close to the bones here so here we can see this is the popliteal artery and in front of popliteal artery there is oblique popliteal ligament and in front of oblique popliteal ligament there uh, we saw in the previous two picture there is the posterior cruciate ligament so the oblique popliteal ligament it lies between the this posterior cruciate ligament and the popliteal artery so the oblique popliteal, uh, popliteal ligament it lies between these two important structures here we also can see here the popliteal artery and this popliteal artery it is very deep and very difficult to palpate and it is very close to the bones in the popliteal fossa so our final answer this is the popliteal ligament because the popliteal ligament it lies between the posterior cruciate ligament and popliteal artery thank you all well.